All right, guys, you are welcome back to this channel. Today, I want to share with you my experience using Restream for my live streaming. Actually, I can say to you that what I have not been able to achieve for the past eight months, so eight to 10 months, I achieved it in just a single video, a single live stream in one day. Wow. You can just imagine getting 721,000 views in a single live stream. And this single live stream gave me over 1,200 subscribers with 7,000 plus watch hour. I mean 7,000 plus watch hour. So actually, if you are upcoming YouTubers like me, if you have been struggling in getting your 4,000 watch hour, if you have been struggling in getting your 1,000 subscribers, this video is for you, okay? It's for you in the sense that you might have been struggling for couples of months without knowing what to do. Maybe you are the person that you have tried in uploading and you are not getting views, you are not getting the watch hours you need, you are not getting the subscribers you need, and you have actually tried your best, actually this video is for you. I will show you exactly what I did to achieve these 721,000 views and 1,200 plus subscribers with over 7,000 watch hour in just a single live stream. <laughs> Guys, that's just amazing. That is so hard to believe, okay? But I will share with you everything. I'm going to show you everything on this channel, how it went, how everything just happened. It's not a lie, okay? And uh, <laughs> I'm not seeing what, the, uh, what I've not done. It's what I've done, okay? And I want to share with you because this is going to help you in order to, to make that journey faster. I want to believe everybody want to be monetized on YouTube. At least it's not easy creating content, even the time to edit the video, thinking of what to do and lots more. And at the end of the day, you are not getting the right views you need and the subscribers and the water you need in order to be eligible for YouTube monetization. So don't skip any part of this video. Just watch the step by steps. But there are some things you need to do if you want to actually get a positive result from this uh, restream.io for your live streaming. Actually, I didn't get it right the first time. The first day I did it, I get about 240 views. And the second time I did it, I get about 260 something views. Okay. But the third day, the third time I'm going live with this restream.io, uh, I got 721,000 views. That's so uh, unbelievable. But that is what I got. Okay. So uh, you just have to go and look for content. What you want to stream, you just have to go and look for something entertaining, something that you know that people will love to watch, okay? You can go to anywhere to get the content. Don't be too proud to say you cannot copy, you don't want to copy other people's content. You just have to do so. But why doing this? You just have to do it with sense. Hmm? You don't just go and copy someone's content and just bring to your channel. It doesn't work that way, all right? So when you get someone's content, one, you look for content that does not have logo or watermark that can implicate your channel, all right? So when you get this content, you know that this thing is entertaining, okay, or engaging. You know that people will want to watch this, all right? So you need to do some adjustments. So you just have to edit part of the video, modify it. You can change the audio, the sound, add your own video, modify it, okay, so that it doesn't look original the same way from where you got it from, all right? So these are basic video editings. Just do some some basic editing to it, all right? To make it look different from the original uh, clip or video you are using, okay? So, and you now go to Restream to live stream into your channel. And there are some settings you need to do before you go live on Restream so that it works well with your channel. I have gotten so many questions whereby some people said they didn't get views. Uh, they cannot use the loop option sorry so i'm going to show you there is no way you must get view you will get view if you follow my steps <laughs> the guides i'm going to give to you you will actually get views all right so i will show you everything and uh, how to do it properly all right so because as i'm talking to you now i'm so excited because i have met the watch R. or well, let me show you a little story of myself you know i started my channel about eight to 10 months ago or 11 months ago and you know i'm a graphic designer i'm a video editor and i create content i do tutorials on my channel actually i've even surpassed the 1000 subscribers but the watch hour has been my issue because for the past 10 to 11 months my watch hour has just been 2000 plus watch hour you no know, and i need to get about 4000 watch hours all right so and uh, 
uh, it has not been easy okay but i've been hearing about this rest stream couple of months and i've been skeptical about it maybe it is real or not real and if i just i don't want to just jump into it i just want to confirm and having confirmed that this thing is legit and it is real that was why i, I give it a try and the way i did it is what i'm going to show you all right so but i just want you to have the knowledge don't just jump when you see anything trading don't just jump on it you need to find out how is it going to be how was what are the process to follow what are the things to do all right so you don't just jump on something without having full knowledge about it all right so uh i will not recommend this for anyone just creating is a youtube channel maybe you are just creating your channel you are just starting up fresh in fact you have less than 10 subscribers <laughs> I will not i will not recommend this for you I, I will still want you to go and learn you, you understand gather your audience uh go to your niche gather your audience create content for people okay so don't just jump into it but if you have been the one struggling you have been struggling like hi and others new youtubers you can actually adopt this and follow the rules all right so that is just that about that guys so let me quickly show you the step by steps what i actually did to achieve this amazing and wonderful result all right all right guys uh let me show you the amazing and wonderful result i've been talking about okay so all right this is my channel okay so let me come to content all right so this is content so i want to come to live for you to see you know i have videos shots here is live video i have three live videos here as i've said earlier so the first one i did it six days ago i i had 247 views stream for 31 minutes that's the last one here okay and the middle one i streamed that five days ago and i had 266 views i streamed that for three hours and the last one the almighty one that paved way for my channel okay i streamed that four days ago and uh, you can see 721k views 700 not 7000 no. Mm? not 700 views not 7000 views 700000 views okay so and stream that for 9 hours okay 44 minutes all right all right guys so let me show you some things under analytics okay analytics so here is my analytics you can see views i have 742.4 thousand views this is for the past 28 days all right so you can see the top content here is the live stream which gave me 721000.3 that's 721,300 views, okay? And uh, look at the watch time. Wow. 7.3 watch hours. 7.3, that's 7,300 watch hours. Not 700 watch hours. 7,000. Of which I just <laughs> needed 4,000. I've been looking for 4,000. <laughs> All this why. Guys, see. All right. Look at the subscribers, guys. I got 1.2 subscribers. That's, imagine. So you can see the top content here just a single live stream so and so on and so forth guys what test do you want to see to believe this thing is working hmm? you can see revenue is now it's now showing on my channel oh wow i'm so excited seeing revenue hmm? so what test do you want to see guys sincerely speaking this thing has been working all right so let me tap on this end this monetization page you can see so i have i'm done with the first step i'm done with the second step so i'm at the third step hmm? where my channel will be reviewed okay and i'm going to come back to share with you guys when this is done all right so without wasting time guys let me just go straight to what i did so as i have told you you need to go to Restream. so let me go to Restream. go to your browser type Restream or restream whatever you call it dot io you can see So this is the page. So you allow it to load. All right. So when the page loads like this, okay, okay, this okay. When it loads like this, guys, you may you may need to sign up as a first time user. Okay, so you may need to sign up. But me, I'm already uh, signed in. I've, but I've already logged in here. You can see my name is there. My channel name is there. Kenneth Digital. All right. So uh, what you just have to do first. All right. Tap on this new stream. You can see new stream. Mm -hmm. So you have a page like this. When you have a page like this, 
what you just need to do is to tap on Restream Studio, the first option on the list. Tap on Restream Studio, okay? Don't make mistake here. Just follow the steps. So allow it to load. So after that, it will come up with something like this. Your name, whatever you like, just put it there. Okay, just put it there. And make sure this mic and camera is turned off. You can see this mic and camera icon. Make sure they are turned off. All right, make sure they are turned off. So you can just put your name. My name is Derek Ernest. Enter Studio. Then you tap Enter Studio. You allow it to load. You can see joining. All right. So when it load up like this, this is what you have. Okay, guys. Then the next thing you do is to connect your channel. So you can see plus channel here. So you tap on this plus. So my channel is already linked here. So I need to turn it on. And I tap on save. So immediately you register, please go to channel to add your channel, please. If you have not added your channel, immediately you sign up on this website. Go to channel under the hamburger sign, you see channel, add your YouTube channel, okay? So that you'll be able to turn it on here whenever you want to go live, when you want to start your streaming. So having gotten to this level, what you just have to do next is to tap on this add scene. Look at it here, add scene. So when you tap on add scene, come down here it depend it may depend on your browser but you will see something like this tap on media this media okay so then you will come to this place to this uh screen here hmm? then you tap on video so this will take you to your gallery but you can see here i already have three videos i have uploaded earlier so you can upload more than three videos using the free version okay so i already have three videos so let me delete one and upload one for you to see i will delete this one it remains two so uh for if you are just starting afresh you will not see any video here so just have to tap on upload video this upload video it takes you to the gallery all right so let me just add one short video just for you to understand so let me tap this one and done so you allow it to load So you can see it's uploading. So you can see analyzing, processing, just allow it to complete the process itself. Okay. All right, it's done. So after that, you can tap on the video. So once you tap on the video, it will load up and show up here. So you can see that's the video, guys so then you need to tap these three dots there is a three dots on this video you, can you see three dots on this video so you need to tap loop video this loop video option will make your video to replay once it ends it starts over again so it, you can go live as many hours as possible with a one minute video because it replays automatically okay so i tap on this loop video so for me to confirm that loop has been selected tap on the three button again you can see it has been marked and that's all you don't need to do any other thing guys then you need to come here this place you can see there's something like landscape and portrait here so you tap on this portrait so i have learned that youtube will push video on portrait more than video in landscape so make sure your video is in portrait if you want to get more views okay so have you done that you can see there is uh, an icon showing on the video showing my name just like k my logo so that is people that are connected or online so you can tap this woman icon or head icon here so and turn it off turn it off here you can see it is gone all right so the next after is the message or conversation so you will see people that that, that comment on your life why you are streaming okay and the next you can see so here you can just leave it like this please like and subscribe and whatever whatever like that so you can just leave. if you want to turn off any of any of it just tap on it and it is it you can see hide or tap on it show all right when you are done with all these settings they are not actually needed the ones that are needed is the portrait and the landscape option here so you can see 
so when you have selected you can select any of these options but i love this particular one or this one so either choose this spotlight or this picture in picture okay so any of it is better then when you are done you now come down here look at it come down here to go live so once i tap this go live then i will be live on my channel all right so and uh, another thing you need to do i've seen many people you'll be seeing restream on their channel because if you don't rename the video restream video will be showing on your channel so you come up here you can see if you don't change this the name of that live stream will be showing live with restream on your channel so tap on this uh pencil icon edit to put the name so maybe the name is a uh, housewarming video for instance so you can see so you tap on save so it is going to change to house warming video you can see it has changed and you could like that guys this is just what you have to do but don't forget you need to use engaging video entertaining video so that your audience and other people on youtube will be able to watch your video something engaging and entertaining will be better do do it this way then go to your channel go and check if the video is playing and uh, ensure that you are checking this page often and often so that your network does not fail you so that it doesn't disconnect okay so guys so that's just what i did all right guys you have seen what i did how i did it the result you know i'm super super excited right now guys because you can just imagine i've been working all this while creating content you know it is my time it is my time to start getting that that dollar too all right so uh guys follow the steps i've explained okay and try it on your channel if you have any questions maybe you still don't get some things right feel free to come to me i'm going to respond i'm going to help you out we are necessary all right if you have actually gotten value from this particular video please give it a thumbs up all right and if you are new to this channel kindly subscribe so that you stay tuned as i will still be releasing more and more amazing tips on how you can grow your channel as a youtuber or as a content creator all right so and by the time uh my, i'm fully monetized you know i've submitted my request right now so i'm waiting for everything to be completed so i'll still come back to share with you the testimony okay maybe we are going to share the first <laughs> this <little laughs> I'll, I'll just come back here to share with you the testimony all right because i'm so so happy right now to share my experience with you all right guys i'm going to see you in another video bye